What is up guys, this is Lentio coming at you today with a discussion about a very interesting field spell that's been announced for the Dark Illusion set, and that card is Semi Spell Zone. I haven't been this excited for a field spell since Chicken Game was first announced, just because of how interesting it was, and this one as well, it's pretty darn interesting. So it is a normal field spell as you would expect, and its effect is, activate this card at the start of your main phase one, or Two. During each player's main phase one, monsters on the field cannot be targeted or destroyed by their controller's opponent's card effects. You cannot activate or set field spell cards. So it's a bit of a weirdly worded card this for me. I had to read it a couple of times because it was just a bit weird. I didn't really understand what was going on with this card, what they were trying to do with it. But let's break it down. So first off, you can only activate this at the start of your main phase one or main phase two. Basically, the first thing you have to do is activate this or you cannot activate it at all in that phase. So if you activate Terraforming in main phase one, the only time you're gonna be able to activate it in your first turn that you've searched it is main phase two, because there's already been an action that's happened. During each player's main phase one, so it's only to do with the main phase one. So it's basically what people normally do is set up their combos and such, and then obviously proceed to the battle phase to do certain things. This is only for your main phase one. Monsters on the field cannot be targeted or destroyed by the controller's opponent's card effects. That basically means I control this field spell, I'm playing monsters in my main phase one, my opponent cannot destroy or target my own monsters with their effects. Likewise, this works with the opponent. I own the field spell, but if they're in their main phase one, I cannot target their opponent's monsters with card effects or destroy them with card effects. So it's much like Chicken Game, it has double use for you and your opponent. Both players can use the card. And the last thing is simply, you cannot activate or set spell cards. So that's basically you can't activate something over it or you can't set something over it and then activate something else. That basically just means you're stuck with this card unless it gets destroyed in some way, shape or form with MST, Twin Twister, so on and so forth. But let's break it down because at first this card seems really ridiculous. So the fact that you basically have a Magispecta effect for your whole field for main phase one. So you can comfortably go off with your own combos and you can't be destructed by bottomless trap hole, treacherous trap hole, torrential tribute, anything like that that would wipe out your board, you are protected. Straight away, the only decks that I think can really take use of this card are OTK decks. Things like heretics and just in general stuff that would need certain protection from your opponent's card effects really benefits from this. You can't really put this in any other deck. It doesn't really work because that means that you hinder yourself. If you don't kill your opponent, then they get the protection from this card effect. So what is the point? The other thing is you would literally have no real use to activate this card in your main phase two because you don't get the protection of the card in your main phase two. You might as well just keep it in your hand. If this card didn't say you activate it during your main phase one or two, then that would be really ridiculous. <laughs> Simply because you could go like terraforming into chicken game, chicken game, all this stuff, and then once you've done all your drawing, slap this bad boy down, start doing your combos. I think this card's only really good in OTK decks. As I said, I don't really see the reason why it will be used in anything else, because you just give your opponent as much advantage that you're gaining from the card. If you have any form of back row cards, they're pretty much useless unless they don't target or destroy your opponent's monsters. I really like what Konami are doing with these field spells because, you know, before, say for example, Grand Spellbook Tower, there were no real amazing field spells, and recent times we've had a lot more good ones just for archetypes and non-archetypes. Overall, really interesting card. Definitely gonna try it out on a couple of OTK decks that I do have. Shame it doesn't protect you in the battle phase, but that might be a little bit too ridiculous if it just basically gave you a free pass to try and destroy your opponent. So I wanna know what you guys think of the awesome semi spell zone. Do you think it's a really good card that could be used in OTK decks? Do you think it could be applied to any other decks? Or do you just think it's an interesting card, but it won't actually be used? So I'd say let me know down in the comment section below. Make sure to give me a like, comment, subscribe, and I shall catch you guys later.